Welcome back to Simulacra. Next thing to do is blackmail Merv, the coworker who's been harassing us, to see if we can get them to do our bidding, which is get the information from Anna's work computer. Before that, though, Ashley said something. You, still creeping through Anna's phone? It's a necessary evil. The only evil here is you. How the fuck did it end up like this? He said Greg checked her home, right? Did he find anything? And she went to meet a spark date. She actually did it. Oh god, do you think she... Oh, fuck. I was the one who told her to use it. It's all my fault. You wouldn't have known. Here I am a mess and some strangers comforting me. I can't just sit around anymore. Unlike you, I'm going to do something about it. Hey, I'm doing something? Are you kidding me? I'm doing all the heavy lifting here. All right, Merv the perv. Hello, lover boy. Anna! Where have you been? Everyone's been looking for you. Hmm. I need a favor. You never asked me for anything before. What gives? I need you to get a phone backup from my PC. Using another employee's PC is against policy. Why can't you do it yourself? Mm, I have to attend a family emergency. That can't be right. Shit. You're not Anna, are you? Fuck, I should have known. Okay, we're done. Wait, what do you mean that can't be right? How do you know that's not right? Hmm. I guess you like being known as a pervert. Blackmail? Is that what's happening? You know I can get sued for sharing company secrets, right? If you still want to access Anna's computer, I am not doing it. How about I send your emails to HR? No, 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 no. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> that was easy. It's hard to hold this job in this economy as it is. I need to get a password reset for her PC, but HR will text her phone to verify. You have to pretend to be Anna, otherwise it'll never give me access. I'm a pro. You've done this before? Jeez. Just make it quick, okay? HR. Hey, Anne, got your password reset request, but I didn't see you in today. Is everything okay? You know what? Let me bring up my notes app, just in case I need some personal information. There we go. Hmm. You wouldn't recognize me because of my new haircut. <laughs> it's a shit excuse. Mm. Ah, I was in and out of the bathroom. Stomach troubles. If you're not feeling well, just take the day off, okay? Before I reset your password, can I run something by you first? Anything. You know the report you handed to me last week? I finally got to it. That report you handed me last week. So I remember there was a, I think it was an email. Elizabeth? Yeah, right. They wanted study leave. Checking up on that. And then 
Elizabeth said, hey, got your application, but the boss is sitting on it for now. It's regarding that thing you brought up. Tell me when you're in the office and I'll explain. It's regarding that thing. I don't think that thing is the study leave. What is it? Is it the only email for them? Let's go back through all the Faraday stuff. Or, uh, but yeah, Faraday Safety is the name of the place. Yeah. Data packets I asked for, blah, 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 disobeying instructions, yelling from the CEO. And then Anna got help from tech support, Edward. We got the Elizabeth study leave. Merv being perv. And that's it. So I don't actually know what the thing is, do I? Ah, yes. I hope that everything's in order. Yes, but I do need to clarify something. It says here that you're making an official sexual harassment report against Merv. Oh, so Anna was already... already doing it. Yep, that's the one. I brought this up with my manager, and he told me to tell you to seriously think about this. Our company can't afford to get into a scandal right now, and sending lewd emails while technically is reportable, it is one of the smaller offense. <laughs> oh, Elizabeth, you're a piece of shit. Yeah, just a reminder to everybody out there, HR is not your friend. They're not there to protect you, they're there to protect the company. What tactic should I take here? I mean, I want to push back against this, but is Elizabeth going to reset my password if I do? Let's push back. That's ridiculous. I'm probably going to regret this. His words, not mine. Oh, shut up. So he suggests you drop the report while he'll have a talk with Merv. Put it all behind and you might approve that study leave you've been meaning to get. But if you want, you can still let the report go through. Forcing Mr. Faraday's hand is just going to upset him. Ah, so the study leaves being held hostage. Interesting. Justice is more important. Send the report. If you insist. Okay, consider it done. Personally, I think you're doing the right thing. Do you? Uh, oops, almost forgot. Just reset your password. See you at the barbecue. Got the reset, and I'm in. Still clear on your task? Yeah, yeah, I get the phone back up, right? Give me a sec. It's starting now. Gonna take a while to... Yeah, cats are fighting in the background. <laughs> Gonna take a while to complete. Don't understand what's going on, but you're not the only one who wants access to this computer. There's someone else? Well, I'm waiting for the reset. Some dude came by demanding to use Anna's computer. It caused quite a scene and security took him away. I think his name was Greg. Is he with you? Mm, I don't know that person. Barging in here is a bad idea. Security won't let this go easily. Finally, it's done. Ooh, did you? Ooh. Did you get it? Yes, I did. Oh, here we go again. There's Ulnar again. Have you found her yet? Not yet. Shh. 
she is running out of time. You need to hurry. Can you help me? Find me. The answer is in Spark. That's what I've been trying to do. Her survival and many more depends on you. She met me. She met it. I'm not it. It's not me. Find me. Find it. I still don't know who you are. I cannot remember. Time is short. If you fail, she will share my fate. He's sending emojis. <laughs> okay, the eyes are getting bigger. And they're dead. Rip. Look at this. Look at this crap. This entire email is in the subject line, and it's all in caps. That's just rude. Like, internet rude. God, and my dumb colleague won't stop texting me. But would not. <laughs> oh, God. I cannot wait to leave there and work with animals. Yeah, because animals don't treat me like garbage. Still waiting on my vet school application, though. Hope I get it. No, we know from that other video they didn't get in. Or... Actually, no. This this video was after the video saying that they were rejected. So they must have been rejected for some other place. It froze for a bit. Did you get the backup? Yeah, I got it. I've done everything you told me. Can I go now? I trust you're going to keep my chats with Anna a secret? <laughs> Sorry, creep. You're done for. What? You fucking fuck. Were you going to say something else? That's it? That's it. Fuck, shit, I think I'm in trouble. I went to Anna's workplace. Something bad happened. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, fuck, I slipped up. How the heck... How the heck could I know that someone else would be at her computer? You could have asked me first. Why do I need permission from you to do anything? Ugh. Too late for that now. This is real bad. The cops are involved now. They also know about your break-in. How the hell do they know about that? Fuck. It must be that nosy granny next door. Do me a favor. Don't get the cops involved anymore. I cannot get another target on me. I'll be arrested for sure. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I don't care about Greg. Fuck Greg. I'll probably get a bad end this time. And maybe next time I won't fuck Greg. But this time, fuck Greg. I don't want to obstruct justice. Hey, I am justice here. 
I'm going to keep looking for Anna alone. You just stay quiet. I am justice. All right, Greg. Sure. What? I'm sorry. What? What is that, Merv? I was just called to HR. We had a fucking deal. Should have known you're going to set me up. Fuck off. Fuck off my life. That's okay. <laughs> from well, email from Spark. Six ways globalization can help you find love. The world is our oyster. It's real, connected, and more than ever before, we can get anywhere at a fraction of the cost during our grandparents' time. What? I understand what I was trying to say, but God. Oof. We can get anywhere at the fraction of the cost during our grandparents' time. That's quite a sentence. It's a great period to fall in love. Here are the six ways we think you can use globalization to your advantage. Mm, data connection. I guess I won't read all the details. Data connection, niche interest, digital booking, language bridge, cheap flights, social media. From Tim Faraday. What were you thinking, Anna? I told you sacrifices must be made in the interest of the company. I'm now certain if you can only think... You can only think for yourself. We're in the midst of reviewing the contract of our biggest client. And now that Merv is under investigation, they're pulling out. I hope that you're happy. All you have to show for is shoddy work, delayed submissions, multiple day offs, and now missing work days. Blah, 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 blah. Go fuck yourself. From Faraday Safety, statement we're temporarily suspect. Yeah. Hello, can you hear me? This is Detective Marillo from the police department. Again. One of your colleagues reported that someone is attempting an unauthorized access to your work computer to retrieve some sensitive information. This is a case of corporate espionage, and we have reason to believe that a man named Greg Summers is behind it. I'm informing you that your personal data has been compromised, and that Greg is now wanted for questioning. If you have any information on his whereabouts, please contact me on this number. Thank you, and good day. I, I do, I think. Do I know where they are? I'm going to try to call Marilla in just a second. We're temporarily suspending our tech director due to sexual... Wait, wait, sexual assault? I thought it was sexual harassment. Sexual assault's a whole different level. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be harassment. I hope. I mean... Yeah, if you're sexually assaulted, you wouldn't go to HR. You'd go to the police, surely. Um, phone, Marillo. All right. <laughs> Actually, before, should I do chats before or after Spark? Let's do it before. Busted. So this is just Taylor and me now. Greg's left. Yo, yo, yo. Don't mean to rush, but it's been a while. Did the blackmailing work? Um, yeah, went perfectly, I guess. Except for the demon. Nice. So, what'd you find in the past Spark messages? Just read all of them and find out who Anna met with uh, exactly. Make sure you get all of them. Let's come back to that conversation. Ashley. Wait, what's the new stuff? I guess just the stuff after this? Right, we heard this message saying sorry. Wait, um, God. I just read my... Um, Ashley, like we talked about, just get on Spark. Anna, I don't know. I will make your profile for you. Ashley said in all caps. Come on, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fun. I'll take care of everything, okay? I'm gonna make your profile so good that even you would date yourself. And I think it's time to unleash the 
Hey, my eyes are up here, dress. You're not going back to Greg, so what's the harm? Anna, hmm. You can come over to my place tomorrow, and we can swipe. But I don't feel like going out. Ashley, heart. Anna, heart. Ashley, I'm excited to see Toby. Anna, <laughs> I'll text you later. Ashley, did you get Spark? Anna, no. I don't know if I really want to. I don't know if I really want to. I know I could date, but it feels like those apps are just objectifying anyway. Dismissing people like an emperor at the Coliseum. Except, I guess they get no chance to fight because you're just looking at some stranger's selfies wondering if that's really their dog or if his ex took the photo. Ashley. Hey, it's just supposed to be fun. We're not looking for your husband. Just like visual stimulus. <laughs> Anna, bleh. Ashley, sorry. Anna, blurgs extend tiny mouths that also blurg like alien. Ashley, oh baby. Anna, I should just focus on getting out of this dumb job. Ashley, maybe. 8th of August. Ashley, hi. See you later today, okay? And then a couple hours later, Anna, answer me. And then Anna. Crap, sorry, 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 almost there. Okay, I was doing an errand and it turned into a longer thing than I thought. Just stay put at the door, I'll, I'll be there soon. 10th of August, Ashley. So, how is boy hunting? Anna. Um. Ashley. Oh, you dog. Anna, shut up, shut up. There is this guy, okay? I don't want to jinx it. Ashley, <laughs> so what's he like? Anna, I'll tell you next time, okay? I might meet him. Ashley, oh. Anna, don't make this a big deal. Ashley, okay, okay. As you are, you are? I'm not sure what that means. As hard as it is for you to believe, I'm going to wait patiently. Anna, liar. Ashley, <laughs> shut up. I'll leave you be. Alright, just spark now. All this recovered from James, so you must be Alner. Works at Fresh Ideas. I've been called metrosexual, but it's not what you think. I'm not attracted to trains. Oh, shut up. Oh, that's a lot of things to recover. Um, I mean, let's do that last, right? Let's go to the beginning. Oh, that's a lot of messages. <sighs> Fingers getting tired. Eh. 7th of August. James, let me guess. Cat person. Anna, smiley face. Too easy. Bet you get that wrong half the time. James, got it right every time so far. Anna, <laughs> how many times is that? James, once. Anna, another spark newbie. James, good thing you showed up. It was starting to get dull. Anna, what, can't find any matches? James, excited, happy face? Anna, for real, this is your first chat on spark? James, I have some. By that I mean one. Anna, that can't be true. James, it is. Cross my heart. Anna, what's wrong with her? James, I'd rather talk about you. Anna, <laughs> sorry, I'm just new to this. Got some really, really strange matches. James, oh dear. Oh, um, hope I'm doing alright so far. Anna, I'll take normal over anything at this point. 8th of August, James. Good morning. Anna, what are you doing up so early? James, I'd ask you the same thing. Anna, work starts at 7 for me. James, yikes. Anna, yep. James, what do you do? Anna, you'll never guess. James, what? Anna, surveillance tech. James, funny, you don't seem like the techie. Anna, I'm not. How about you? I'm a copywriter making crappy stuff sound better than it looks. 
Anna. You must be a smooth texter then, James. Only when it comes to seducing corporate clients. Anna. <laughs> you still with them? James. It didn't work out. So if you ever thought of putting on power suits and writing for big brands... My position at Fresh Ideas is open still. Still open. Your problems are solutions. Web designs. Branding. App development. Join us. Please fill out your details below and one of our representatives will contact you soon. Ooh, I can actually fill it out. Probably going to need to do that. This website uses cookies. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, before I fill this out, I think I should read more. Because I don't even know what their position is called. I guess copywriter? Actually, yeah. Why not? <laughs> I was about to write Maya Crane. Whoops, that's the second game. Let's try Anna Hardy. Again, assuming that Hardy is uh, because it's their mom's name, it's maybe still Anna's name. Not sure. I don't think they've been married, but... But it's possible that their mother remarried and had their name changed. So, not sure that that's actually Anna's last name. Thank you. Thank you for your interest in joining our ever-growing family. Before we commence the interview, it's our policy to engage a preliminary chat with all of our applicants beforehand. When you're ready, please contact our HR representative, Phil. He'll guide you through the entire process. Wow, so that actually, that actually worked. Of course, I don't actually know the purpose of doing this. I probably shouldn't do it until I read more of this conversation. Every time I leave this window, I got to scroll back up. Anna, I think I'll pass. James, why stick around? Anna, where? James, your job, you hate it, right? Anna, oh. Yeah. How'd you know? James, just making a guess. Anna, you got me. You think I should just quit? James, totes. Anna, so I'll just walk up to my boss and say, Hey, I don't want money. Okay, thanks, bye. James, I'm not kidding, Anna. If it's not right for you, just walk away. Like you did with your previous guy. Anna, oh my god, how did you know? James, Cool sunglasses emoji. Spark is rebound city. For most people, anyway. I just took a guess. Anna, you stalking me? You have an unnatural talent of guessing my backstory. James, didn't have to, Anna. You're an open book and so easy to read. I just connected the dots. Anna, okay, smart guy. What else can you read? James, I think you should just take a break from everything. From the job you hate, from your previous guy, whatever happened. Take a vacay and start new. Anna, that's so what I need right now. For a guy I barely met, how come you know so much about me? James, call it intuition. I'm just going to stop for a second. I think the reason James knows so much about Anna is because I don't think this actually is James. I think this is the simulacra. The Ripple Man. 9th of August, James. So how much of an ass is he? Anna. Who? James. The guy you dumped. Anna. You really want to know? Let's trade. Tell me about the first spark girl. James. You really want to know? Anna, you started it. James, fair enough. When I first started out... Keeping it Cassie? We know them. Um, I matched with this 
girl named um, Cassie, um, also known as at Keeping It Cassie. She's cool, but she's like some big social media person or something. I'm not a fan of the attention. Anna, no way. So you passed a Jabber celeb? Are you even real? James, told you, too much attention. Anna, you're weird. James, good weird? Anna, good weird. James, so, boy problems. Anna, I'll give you one guess what he did. James, he cheated on you. Anna, yep. James, typical. Anna, I know, right? James, were there any signs? Anna, that's a thing. None. Zero. James, I guess sometimes you can never tell. Anna, or is it just me? Am I blind? James, hey, don't say that. Maybe he was good to you, so you saw the good parts of him. Of anybody. And that makes you good. Anna, wow. Did you just make that up? James, is it working? Anna, you're something else, James. James, I'll take that as a compliment. Keep that up and I'll let you see the good parts of me. Anna, well, you did not. Okay, if we keep talking, I'm going to miss work. James, speak soon. 10th of August, James, you should totally record yourself quitting your job. Anna, you don't sleep, do you? James, chatting with you is more fun. Anna, recording myself quitting isn't, though. James, you'll inspire the generation, Anna. Anna, I'm not inspiring anybody. I want to go back to school first. James, college? Oh, which kind? Anna, vet. James, now that sounds more like you. Anna, it does? James, totally. Which one are you going to? Anna, I applied for UC, but I got rejected. James, bastards. Tell you what. I'll teach you how to apply for colleges like a pro. Anna, isn't it just filling up forms? James, hey, I'll write you a kick-ass application. Anna, how? Meet me this weekend and I'll show ya. Anna, smooth. Fine, but you better be actually useful. James, I can think of a few things we can use. Anna, like what? James, depends on my mood, winky face. Anna, fine, I'll find out myself. James, Saturday night, 7 p.m. uptown. Anna, you're lucky that's good timing for me. James, see ya. 12th of August. James, see you soon. Anna, be there in an hour. And then, after the time has passed, I'm here, where are you? James, I see you. And then they met. <laughs> and then Anna went missing. So, 7 p.m. uptown. That's not really a specific location. Maybe I should do the interview now. Hey, Phil. Your interview will start soon. Please wait. This conversation will be recorded for internal use. You there, Phil? All right, let's just start talking to Taylor, I guess. I need to decrypt all of the messages first. Wait, 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 hold on. I remember when I first started looking at these, all the messages at the bottom were encrypted, but now they're not? Yeah. Need to decrypt all of the messages first. Sure, sure. 
Make sure to get all of them so you don't miss out. I'll wait till you're done. And I met with James Alner. James, huh? Sounds pretty normal, actually. I would imagine the culprit to have a scarier name. What else you got? Well, he's unnaturally good at guessing Anna's past. Sounds like stalker material to me. I wonder if there's a way to confirm this. Now, he met at keeping it Cassie before Anna. No way. What a player. She's like a Jabber celeb. Hope she's alright. She looks active on Jabber. If we can somehow talk to her, maybe she can share what she knows about him. He works at, his, at a design firm called Fresh Ideas. That's a pretty cheesy name, even for my taste. Maybe someone there can tell us what's up with him. Looks like we got enough to start with this James fellow. It's close. I can feel it. Yeah, me too. That's what I like to hear. You got the most resources to figure out who this James person is. I think you need to track this Cassie person down and, and call his workplace. Dig a little more about him. I'll track, I'll track Cassie first. As long as you do both, I'll leave it up to you. In the meantime, I'll give Spark a call. Maybe they have something on this James person. Oh, right! The number thing! The fan asked me anything! That was the purpose of it. I did that a long time ago, but then they said they'd get back to me later. It's your turn to ask me anything. Remember, you get only one question. Good timing. Can I ask more than one question? That is itself a question. I'll keep it to one. Awesome possum. <laughs> Ask away. Tell me more about James Ulner. Uh, say what? Him? How the hell do you know about him? He's a, a person of interest. You want dirt on him or something? Why go through me? Don't you have normal questions to ask? Like, what do I think of climate change? Or the state of social media shaping consumerism? You know, normal questions? The A stands for anything. Ugh, fine. If that's what you really want to know, only two conditions. First, tell me, why do you need info on him? He is a key witness in a disappearance. Sweet Jesus! I knew something was up! Oh God, I could have been kidnapped? Look, I'm not sure what you heard, but this sounds seriously effed up. If it's going to help someone else, I'll tell you everything. But this is between us. My second condition is that we keep this between us, okay? Sure. It's a deal. Okay, let me start from the top. I keep my online persona at Keeping a Cassie and my real life separate. My real name is Cassandra. At keeping a Cassie has always been single, but I'm not. I had a longtime boyfriend, but I was dumped. So I went on Spark and chatted with a few guys to get over it. That's when I met James. Anything stands out? Nothing at the beginning, actually. It started out fine. He was a real charmer. Seems to tell me all the right things. 
After coming off a shitty relationship, I was at a low place. He gave me some perspective and plenty of good advice. Then he started to get more things right about me. Sounds creepy to me. That is nothing. Wait till you hear this. He starts to text me exactly when I finish my work. I don't have a regular schedule. They change every week. Days, even. But he somehow managed to text me at exactly the right time. There was a photo shoot that ended at 2 a.m. He texted me the moment the photographer called it a wrap. Does he ever sleep? Okay, that is weird. Here's the final straw. He knew about the breakup. I worked my ass off to keep my relationship a secret for the sake of at keeping it Cassie. And somehow, James knew. I confronted him, and he told me he guessed it. Look, that's the last time I heard from him. Uh, James, did your online persona drive your boyfriend away? Cassie, how the hell do you know about this? James, I just took a guess. Cassie, guessing exactly when I wake up and when I finish work, that is just plain creepy. Finding out about my jabber and boyfriend, that is pure sorcery. No one else knows about this. Who the hell are you? James, are my methods too uncomfortable? Cassie, we are done. That is all I need to know. Okay, are we done? That's it. That's all I'm saying. Just thinking about it makes my hair stand. Your story is going to save lives. You know, I read somewhere that psychopaths try their best to fit in. I feel James is kind of like that. Hope you got what you needed. There's something off about him. Madison Mike, whoop. Madison Mike on Jabber. Something to think about. I fear the day that technology will surpass our human interaction. The world will have a generation of idiots. Albert Einstein. Anna, says the guy who posted this on Jabber. That was, yeah, that was five minutes ago, so Anna replied to this too. Cad, time to up my selfie game. 